lecture i'm going to discuss about how to get list of all tables in database using microsoft sql server by using query so let's see the query so first here write in the select a statement then or this place let's write here table name so table name that's going to select then after let's use here or from n4 mason underscore schema if i press dot here you can or uh, display columns or uh, domains or uh, uh, others but uh, there i'm going to or uh, display here uh, tables so you can see your uh, tables you need to use after that let's use here where clause and uh, there we need to give your uh, table types so table types so with the help of this we can filter so this here writing base table thereafter let's use here and operator and operator then or uh, this here table catalog so inside the table catalog i'm going to give you the table database name so let's give you add so that's it this is a query to get your list of all tables in the database by using query so let's run this here you can see all the tables that's percentage there here you can see this all so whatever the tables that's so inside the atom then you can see how this all that's come there now system database so we can try also so here you can see master is the system database So let's uh, write here master then run. So uh, master here if I go tables. So there is no any tables since the system tables is there. Tables are not present there. Okay. And here if I go models. And here this also has so uh, system tables. Okay. But if I go on this tables, then you can see here this inside this all tables that's percent there. So let's write here Adam. And if I run, then here you can get list of all tables inside Adam database. Okay. So this here using uh, Microsoft SQL Server. If you want to use here MySQL, then you need, can only change your table schema and give the database. All same, but here you can give this only in the MySQL. If I run this query, then here you can see list of all tables that's displaying inside to Sakira database. Here you can see this all that's displaying. So you need to change here this only. Okay. So this is how we can here get list of all tables in database using Microsoft SQL Server. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.